Welcome back to the Sycamore Junior High video announcements. Today is Thursday, September 23rd. I'm Sierra. And I'm Lily. And now, please join us as we all stand, place our hand over our hearts, and honor our country as we say the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, Thank you for joining us, and you may now be seated. Okay, before we get to our main announcements, we have a few quick reminders. Flight Fest is coming up soon. Flight Fest is held on October 16th and is a race containing a 2K, 5K, and 10K. There will be food, music, prizes, and activities. We highly encourage everyone to come to support the school. Also, Spirit, Wo Spirit Week will be held the week before Flight Fest, Monday through Thursday, because Friday we don't have school. Updates will be coming out about the Spirit Week activities, and we hope everyone participates. Did you know that today was declared National Dogs and Politics Day back in 1952? Oh my gosh, I love dogs. They're like actually like legitimately my favorite animal. Well, there have been a lot of former presidents with dogs and cats in the White House. George W. Bush had three dogs with him during the time he was president, but I bet you didn't know that President Clavin, Calvin Coolidge. Calvin Coolidge had a pet pygmy, pygmy hippopotamus gifted to him by somebody in 1927. Now I would love to see that. Next up we have our school club and activity information brought to you by Mr. Harris. Good afternoon Sycamore Junior High and here are your daily announcements. All right I'm gonna mess this up but I'm gonna do my best I can. Bonjour, hola, privet, ni hao, konnichiwa, shalom or hello. The International Club is back this year. Make new friends, play games, make art, learn geography, play sports, sing or dance to music, and learn how to cook dishes from your own and different cultures. World Peace begins right here at Sycamore Junior High. If interested, join the Google Classroom with this code N3N4IOM, and I'm sure they'll put that up on the board so you can see it. If you have any questions, contact Wolf Wolford Sensei in room 214 or via email. Meeting dates and ties will be determined after members sign up. <coughs> Yearbook Club needs photographers. Do you like to take photos of your friends? Would you like to learn more about photography? Then be sure to sign up for the Yearbook Club. Our first meeting will be Wednesday, September 29th after school until 4 o'clock in room 246. That's Mrs. Spielman's art room. Be sure to arrange for a ride home from school. Join the Yearbook Club Google Classroom with this code, JCO. D D T B. Again, that'll be up on the screen. Please join even if you are unable to attend the first meeting. I will post a video of the meeting in the Yearbook Club Google Classroom. We want photos from as many students as possible to document this school year. Help shape our 2022 Sycamore Junior High School Yearbook. <coughs> students interested in participating in math club this year should plan to meet Mr. Miles in room 137 on Wednesday, September 29th right after school until about 4 o'clock. Students will compete in both online and in-person competitions between October and March. If you have any questions, please reach out to Mr. Miles via email. If you're interested in joining the 2021-22 Sycamore Junior High Swimming and Diving Team, that meeting will be Wednesday, October 6th at 3.15 in the cafeteria. <coughs> that meeting will last only about 30 minutes, so make sure you have a ride to take you home the season starts the week of November 1st, and practices will be at Sycamore High School. And last but not least, if you have lunch in the wrestling room cafeteria, remember to bring your first class tickets to lunch this Friday. The first first class ticket store will be open this Friday for you to spend those first class tickets, and that'll be in the wrestling room. That's all of our announcements. Have a great day. And now a very important announcement from our principal team. Hello students of Sycamore Junior High, this is Assistant Principal Molly Bernoski, an announcement about the football games coming up. First of all, we'd like to address incidents that occurred at the varsity football game last Friday night. And first, we want to thank everybody for coming out and cheering on our student athletes, our band members, and our flyerettes. We'd like to also praise the vast majority of students whose behavior was a true reflection of our students' conduct at Sycamore Junior High. Unfortunately, we had a couple of incidents elsewhere at the game that were unacceptable and not, will not be tolerated. And in order to prevent these types of situations from occurring again, the high school has set some new rules that will be enforced for future football games. 
High school students attending, attending the game must be in the student section. Younger students, non-high school, such as junior high students, must be supervised by an adult and preferably seated with these adults. There will be no loitering in the area between the stands and the fence by the track, now the straw area, and all spectators should be seated unless going to the concession stand and returning. Any student engaging in physical or verbal disrespect, abuse, or misconduct is subject to immediate removal, loss of attendance privileges, and school legal disciplinary actions. Book bags and sporting equipment are not permitted to be brought in, and no spectator may leave the stadium and be readmitted. So students in closing, please know that the vast majority of students do the right thing. These new guidelines are to ensure the safety and security of all students and spectators. And we hope that everybody will come out this Friday, October 1st, no, nope, next Friday, October 1st, for our homecoming game to feel the community spirit, cheer on our student athletes, and enjoy the marching band and flyerettes. Hope you have an awesome rest of the day. Good luck to cheer in football, as well as soccer, tennis, and the gold volleyball team. We wish you the best of luck. Great work to everyone on completing the map test. You all did great. Go, Go Aves! Aves.